morning. Good morning. <laughs> it's day 78, um, June 17th then. We are, um, here my hair. I do have hair under there. I always look like a chemo patient. Um, we had a um, really nice night here. It did rain a little bit last night. Um, lots of other people come in and tent over there with, um, um, I think we had about um, three or four other people come in with tents. Um, had a good night. Um, it did rain a little bit on us, but it's looking today like the chance of rain has gone down to 50%, which is a really good thing because um, we left our umbrellas in the back of Wildflower's uh, car last night when she dropped us off, and it was hours later before I realized, and she's hours away. So, bless her heart, she is going to send them to us to Kent so that Hi. we can have them in a few days. Good morning. Um, so, we've got 14.8 miles to <laughs> hike. Um, we're just enjoying having, oh, there's a mosquito. Here they are. Oh, gosh, it got away. Get away. Get away. Oh, we got to put some deed on. Um, but they have a shower there. It's a cold shower, but a utility sink, utility tub there, utility sink, um, water tap there, two porta potties over there. Um, obviously, this covered pavilion with electrical outlets, so we're charging everything up, and um, <clears throat> picnic tables. Uh, it's just, just been really nice. There's even a grill there. I see. There's also some tinting space down there. There's some gentleman down there named Blaze that was playing baseball with the kids last night. And Rightway was playing baseball with the kids. They had some equipment in there. Um, but this was just really nice. Um, really nice place. Uh, there was some confusion last night. We were invited to uh, we have participate. Hmm? Yeah, we were invited to, to participate in the picnic last night by several people who were in charge and then and then I guess someone else who's maybe more in charge, I don't know, was like, this is a private function, you need to move on. We were like, oh my gosh, we were so embarrassed, but the people who had invited us um, apologized. Yeah, I was raging, I, I would beg. Sorry, she wanted to rage. Um, but the people who had invited us apologized profusely, and I just felt bad because we didn't want to have done anything. But, uh, yeah, all was well. Um, awesome little, I don't know if I got to record, there was so much going on, but I don't know if I got to record the petting zoo. Hopefully I did, at least got some pictures. Nicest people running the petting zoo, and then as, it, as they were cleaning up, it started raining and they were cleaning up. I hopped into the pen and started corralling all the animals. It was awesome. Um... Because they had like, you know, all the ducks and the chickens had to go into one pen and the guinea pigs into the other and the other the pigs in the other. And it was just the funniest thing. Um, it was hilarious. It was so fun to like um, grab all these little animals and put them in their little crate. And it was, it was just so cute. The, the people who were running it were super sweet. And um, um, that was just a really cool experience because the kids didn't get to go to the zoo, the trailside zoo at Bear Mountain. So it's like it got made up for because they had a little, they had a little zoo here. How's that? This is some trail magic that uh, Debbie, um, yeah, let's, like, the zoo. dial a ride, um, had given us. She gave us some bars and this uh, kind, kind trail mix with some Ziploc bags. A couple of bags of that. Again, just the sweetest lady. Such a sweetheart. And you guys are thrilled to have these bats. You're enjoying that. We got to play baseball. Hmm? We got to play baseball. Yeah. Yes. All right. Yeah. Little salamander this morning. Yeah. Hi, little Good baby. Morning. Here, let's show the size of him. Look. Can I Look pick how him small up? he is. Can I pick him up? No. Oh, I, thought I, thought I, thought you, I thought you were going to pick alone. it up, Mom. I thought no, you were gonna I was just showing up. how small and tiny he is. I want to pick it up so, so bad. Cute. Okay, go and leave it alone. Oh, another one! Another oh. one! Yeah. Maybe it's his brother or sister. Yeah. Oh. Bye. oh, that one's hiding. Just watch out! Careful, careful. Yeah, you really got to watch because some yeah, of the leaves... Okay, go on. It's trying to hide. We were, we were just over there using the porta potties and picnic table getting ready to have lunch and good old Tex here came and got us and told us that someone was setting up to do trail magic here. <laughs> 218 and, and 219 are going to be so pissed. Oh, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> but so, um, so this is amazing. What you guys, Don's going to make, you know, 
so their son is hiking, Lexicon, who we have not met yet. Um, this is awesome. This is so amazing. I am, yeah. It just occurred to me, well, we, we started walking on it there, and I just, I just realized we're walking on this, like, wall. <laughs> Some sort of little, I don't know what. It's really cool, though. Yeah, don't do that. What is it? What does it say? Tell me what it says. It says telephone of the wind. We, we made it like 0.5 miles. It was like 0.8 more miles to go. And it started uh, with a thunderstorm coming down on us. We don't have umbrellas. So, oops, where do we go? It's hiker camping over here. Oh, here we go. I see someone set up. There's Tex, he was smart, got himself out of the rain. <laughs> Look at you, clever boy. <laughs> yeah, that trail got tough there for a second. <laughs> All right, I guess we just go this way. I like how it's thunderstorming on us and the sun is shining on us. That's lovely. Oh. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Thank you.